Hello guys, it's Jackson here, welcome back to the video. Today we're going to be doing another minute script tutorial, and in today's episode we're going to be making some key cards. So what a key card is, it is a name tag that has a little name that can open an iron door, but like only specific iron doors of course. And so we're going to go over here, I'm going to show you how it works real quick. We got key card A, and we can right click the door, and if we don't have it, it tells us we need to do it, open it, and then uh, key card B will open this door. So in this tutorial, I'm going to be using Sublime Text. You could use whatever text editor you want. You could even use the Minehunt panel. It doesn't really matter. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to do on right click on iron door. And that just activates when someone right clicks on iron door. Simple enough. Then we're going to do if block under clicked block is green terracotta. And this is how we differentiate between the different types of doors. Basically, any door with a green terracotta underneath it will be locked. And so you'll need key card A to unlock it. Then we're going to go down again and then if name of players held item is. And then you want to have a color code here because if you don't have a color code then a player could literally just name an item with an anvil and would be able to unlock the door. But this way it has to be an item given by an admin or by some like server shop sort of system. So we're going to go down again, enter, and then open, clicked, block. And basically that literally just opens the iron door. It's as simple as that. And then wait one second and then close, click, block. So we want it to close afterwards. I mean, we don't want it to just stay open. And we're going to go down again and we're going to do an else real quick uh, to make sure to tell the player if he can't open the door. And then we're going to do send. And then and seven, uh, you need, and then we'll do something like this to open this door. And that should be it. And then we're going to add one more thing. We're going to wait one second at the bottom. And that'll just make it so if you're holding right click on the door, it doesn't spam you instantly. Like if without this one second, if you right click the door, it'll send you the message like four or five times just because it does it like every tick. And with this, uh, we can save, import it into our server. And well, it should already work. So keycard A should work just fine. We can go in, and we got we got a couple chests. You know, we got we got some nether gold ore. It's not exactly what I wanted. And also one downfall to this little you know keycard sort of script, you can't right click the top part of the door, cause script sucks. And I tried so many different things to get the top part of the door to work too, but I just couldn't figure it out. I'm gonna be honest, guys. If you guys know how to do it, please leave a comment below. So now we're going to quickly do the second key card. So it's going to be like exactly the same. Actually, it's going to be so similar that I'm just going to copy and paste this down here. So we got another right click and then this time we're going to do blue terracotta and this will be key card B. And I believe I have the color code and B right here, which is a light blue. And so, yeah, we are, we got key card B and then you need key card B and then I'll name it and B. Okay, so there we go. I mean, we already set up the second door, so we're going to go back into the game. I'm going to reload the script, and then we'll see what happens. So we now got keycard B, so keycard A won't be able to work on it, but keycard B will. So we can go inside, and we can hop up here, and look, subscribe! <laughs> so that's going to be the end of the video. I will put the, the keycard script down in the description, and like a pacement or something. And if you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'll put the playlist and the cards, the minute script playlist, and my script tutorial playlist if you want to check those stuff out. And again, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will see you guys next time. Goodbye!